going to follow up on some information requests that were outstanding from the previous meeting. I have endeavored to capture them off of the video, and hopefully I've cap captured them all, but let's, let's be sure that uh, uh, we go through this one by one. Um, we got an NHMA wage study comparison uh, on the fire as well as in the police that was, uh, in fact, responsive to our request. Is that true or not true? Not true. Not true. Okay. It what was, was a responsive to it, but the facts that we asked for were not given. What was uh, wrong? Uh, <clears throat> as for surrounding towns, it didn't include surrounding towns, but besides that, um, it, it also doesn't give in reference to what Hampton does, because when I looked at, at the meeting, I said I would try to look up Hampton. It could be there, but I said I couldn't find it. Okay. So I was also expecting within Hampton ranges for the chief, the deputy chief, and the individual people. Now uh -huh. you may, when we have it in our budget, it's all grouped together. So it's very hard to distinguish who's getting what to compare ourselves in relationship to other towns. There, there is a, a challenge here, and it's probably too small to see on the screen there, but uh, I'll have to grab that up and make it bigger. Apparently, NHMA is uh, temporary sus temporarily suspending publication of this wage study because of lack of participation. I, I saw that like 10 towns, including Hampton, did not include any in statistics. Right. So apparently, even NHMA recognizes that it seems to be statistically too anemic to be called valid. <laughs> Do <laughs> um, you like that phrase, all of you do? Eloquently put, sir. Mr. Chairman, yes. may I inquire? You have the floor. Are you talking about the NHMA wage study? Uh, yes. I thought that cost us 15000 to get that that's study. Not, that's separate. What? That's municipal resources. We're yeah. talking about oh, okay. the question that Mr. Mara asked, which absolutely did not get addressed. There is on screen there, Louise. Last week. Oh, okay. Um, Mr. Mara specifically asked, and, and let me start off by saying, there isn't a police department or fire department in this entire state that doesn't know what their neighbor is making. Right. So let's be clear about that, okay? Right. So um, sometimes information you get uh, that you ask for, I almost wish that people would take the time. This wasn't taking the time. I had to print this out twice, and even on my iPad, it's not lined up. So you have to, in other words, here's Claremont, Durham, Hanover, Lebanon. You go to the next page, oh, Claremont. This, the salary is way over to the right. So zero effort was put into this. And if, if there was more than five minutes, I could have done this. Well, to be clear, Brian, yeah. zero effort was put into specifying the format we wanted as well. Well, I don't know. So, okay. I mean, you're, you're talking about a formatting problem, basically, and we didn't specify what format. Okay, well, so. the format aside, Mr. Mara specifically asked for wage comparisons. Mm -hmm. That's a key word. And From NHMA, is that correct? Well, I don't even remember NHMA I, was. I he, asked the police chief and fire police. To, to them to get the information. Yeah, correct. I didn't ask NHMA for anything. The I asked right. them. We'll see further down here. We've got on this list that I grabbed. Yeah. Uh, there's there's a reason. Police Chiefs Association Wage Study. That's what you're referring to now, I believe, right? Police Chiefs Association We're wage combining study. both. Both of them were asked at the same. Well, they're actually with two separate requests. Well, I understand that, but they're well, both. I didn't ask for the police chiefs. What I asked for was the town of Hampton, how they got their information. Yeah. It's for them right. to do, not for me to tell them to go to the so police teacher and the HMA. They I did. think it's a pretty basic question. They did supply. In reference to, pretty basic questions are to what's the salary range for the chief of police in Hampton, and how does it compare to other towns? Mm -hmm. They did supply. What is the, may I finish? Sure. What is the, the salary for a captain within the town of Hampton and compared to surrounding towns around us? Mm -hmm. Like such, in right. average ways, I'm not trying to go after any, any individual person. To give us a study, because like I started it, right, there was too much stuff on TV this summer in reference to teachers going on strike down south because they were so poorly underpaid. So I didn't know when I saw that, what does Hampton do in reference to police, fire, and teachers? So, so with that being said, if it's too low, I want to up them. If it's too high, you say, what do you get that here? So we need something to be able to make our decisions guideline. on, which, yeah. a guideline. That's all I was asking. Yeah. But but you're on the right track. But believe me, it's not too low. Okay? With the police. Okay. And, right. But wait a minute. But, but hold on. This is the key point, Mr. Chairman. The issue that you were raising, and you tried to say it was, it would have been better off if we saw information that stated 
40 year old 40 year police chief or fire chief in the town of yeah. makes seventy thousand dollars after 40 years how does that salary come into play are there merit increases thrown in in the middle of the year without anybody approving it uh, the, the budget gets defeated but we seem to find a way in this town to give everybody a raise so that's what i want to know i don't want to know and by the way i could care less about conway well, why would we care about North Conway and Conway? So at the end of the day, my, my request is going to be this. I want to see a spreadsheet, and we have all the technology that can fit in landscape form or whatever, showing, I'm going to use the word 20 towns. It's not hard to get. 20 towns for both police and fire at the administrative levels, non, the non-union levels, and the other towns, how do they arrive at that? Because you could have somebody here in Hampton that's been here four years that's paid four times as much as somebody that's been in the business 30 years. Mm -hmm. That's important information for the taxpayers to know because it's just like what I'm going to talk about in that municipal resources study. And I talked to three people in high-level positions of the state today, and my, their comment to me was, well, what about the people that came back that were overpaid? We saw that in Liberty Mutual, right, Dave? Probably. When they downgraded yeah. positions, but that's important, and that's what David asked for last week, and he didn't yeah. get it. And what I was hoping to do is go down these line items and simply say whether or not the request was satisfied or not, or whether it's not relevant. Okay. Well, it wasn't satisfied. So okay. let me let me just uh, okay highlight this. So given the qualifier on the NHMA wage study uh, relative to them, quote unquote, temporarily suspending its publication, yep. should we simply not be requesting NHMA wage information for that reason? Well, why does it have to be NHMA? Well, I'm not saying. Should we suspend getting NHMA wage information? Oh, absolutely. For Forget it. Okay. We're getting rid so of that anyway. So NHMA is off the table in terms of a valid source I don't know why for wage it. comparisons. We're in agreement on that? Yes. Right? I, I we're in just, agreement on that, Mary Louise? Well, wait a minute. I don't want to go I, off topic I, I misunderstood here. what you were doing. The wage study that we got through That's the NHMA different. was for non-union positions. Not, it didn't have anything to do with police or fire. So well, that's the that's, only study well, that's I'm correct. aware that's of. That's what we're talking so about. So I see what you're trying to do. The that's request the was police yeah. and fire. Right. But and I'm the saying fire chief was here and he said to do it. And the police chief We understand. We can't do anything about the contractual. Yeah. People. Okay. okay. So I'm canceling the references to wage, NHMA wage studies. Yeah. Uh, Got to be a better way to get that information. Okay. So uh, the amount needed for sufficient protective clothing for 2019. Mm -hmm. We all got copies of that, right? Yes. That's been satisfied? Mm-hmm. Getting the copies has been satisfied. How we're going to go? We got the information. That was the request. We got the information. So Correct. I would like to say that that write-up is outstanding. Yeah. By that's the, a hot button. The, I can tell you in time. By the fire chief, but that's an example of you ask for something, you get all the data, so yeah. you can properly and the, evaluate it. The MRI comparison study, we all got that. Correct. That request we're, has we're been satisfied. Through, yes, we're sifting through it. Yes. But the request has been satisfied. That's yes. correct. Yes. yes. Okay. Police Chief Association wage is still pending, right? Mm -hmm. We haven't heard a word on that. But we, again, to be fair, we asked for, you know, by Thanksgiving, so there's plenty of time there. Um, hardware support. And, and by the way, can, can I just interrupt you, Mr. Chairman? Because it seems to me what Mr. Mara's request was, and watch the tape, I made specific requests of the police chief, and he watched the tape. I'm not interested in. I think I captured later on. Let's go ahead and go okay. down the list, okay? I hope you do. So, the hardware support maintenance repairs, for more detail requested that's still pending from the police chief. Outside agencies, detailed report. Detail. Pay and hours work for outside officer. Title and individual. Can't have a police chief out of town on Hampton Beach. It's absolutely I'd say ridiculous. Per officer, is that sufficient? Abs no, we've got per pay title, records. Per officer, I want per officer slash title. Is that what you want? And name, yes. Per officer applies, assumes name, I think. Yep, and community. And we did say Thanksgiving, so I don't have a problem right. with that. So that's still pending. I just modified the, the statement there. Okay, pay difference between previous and current park and recreation department heads. Christy, uh, we're still pending on that. I assume you have until yes, Thanksgiving. I didn't realize that was a request, but I will mark that. Indeed, it was. I had to have been. I made it. 
Yes. Uh, <laughs> Instant gratification. <laughs> and we also added to that an excellent it's on the video. I went through the whole video trying to get well, everything. Excellent, uh, excellent process, but I do want to add that there was a lot of discussion in relation to the Recreation Department. Where did we arrive or come up with 22000 for a new director's position of the parking? We asked that. I needed that in the study, yeah. too. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so, so that's all I intended to do on the information okay, request. Fine. Yeah, uh, in fine. terms of getting that list validated, yep. uh, it, 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 we can we can add to this list now or wait until after we deal with uh, the rest of the agenda. What's your? Preference? I would say we'll probably get through. Uh, let DPW it's not go fair. through this. Too okay, many fine. People waiting. Fine. Yes. A new information yes, I request. Hope the toilets are working. <laughs> On to new business. New business. We Speaking have a totally new information request. Uh, I understand. Is that correct? In water. Uh, what? Do we have new information requests? Well, I don't know whether you would consider this a new information request, but I am happy to... Uh, no, it's not about the schedule. That's coming up. What about the vehicles? What about the vehicles? I, I don't know. You guys were talking back and forth. There is no the, new information no request information. on that. Okay. We're all happy with the vehicle report. Okay, thank you. Okay. So I have one one request. And no. Christy, no, 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 no. <coughs> Christy, I don't know whether you want to hear this or not. You may want to you stay for this topic in general. Ten million dollars worth of course, course. Uh, But I it may be more appropriate for the, uh, even you, uh, Frank, Jamie, you or even uh, Mary Louise. No, no. Yeah, I, just, I don't think you're it's the form. No, I have been not trying not to work quietly issue. behind the scenes yeah. to actually acquire the numbers for the default budget. I watch your meetings. Now this is the first time that we've got a budget book where the default budget column is all zero. Okay. Now, I find it necessary to make an, inf an official in, uh, information request for the default budget. Understood. Okay. Who should I be asking that request of? You just did, and we'll pass that on. Please. Thank you, Mr. Manager. There. So, on the on the new request is the default budget. Good. Any other new information requests? I don't understand why we can't have Jen or Chris come back for an hour of their time to go over each of the vehicles. We used to do this all the we time. We can. Right, well, now, the that's right now the topic is new information requests. Are there any? I'm hearing none. Uh, Great. The, well, we're not. Well, okay. before you said new information requests, what about uh, we're definitely going to get um, the police outside agencies. I'll wait to see okay. that to believe it. Can I get the cable TV guys to give me the monitor back, please? Yeah, that's still on the uh, on the sheet. Outside agencies detail report of By 2018 pay and hours work per outside officer slash title slash organization. All right. Yeah. And thank Mary Louise for being here tonight. You add a lot of value, as you always do. Answer: Is there any other information request desired? Okay. Good. Uh,